Hey guys, welcome along. In this short video, I'm going to show you my five top keyboard shortcuts in Excel. And if you want a downloadable PDF file that contains all of these shortcuts, then just check the download link in the description below. So let's crack on then. The first one, how you can make an exact copy of a sheet. These are all based around the control key. They are Windows specific, but I will put in the description the, uh, the Apple Mac equivalents. So to make an exact copy of a sheet, all the column widths, all the formula, all the formats, etc., you simply just hold down the control key, hover over the tab there, and click and drag to the right, and it, it will make a copy of that for you. I'm not sure I didn't quite hang on to that. So um, believe me, that's made an exact copy of this room sheet, and it's just called it Rooms 2. So that's how you can do that one. The second thing is how you can make multiple entries to a whole bunch of cells at the same time. So what I mean here then is that if you wanted for some reason to put the same entry into this whole bunch of cells here, you can select the cells in the first place, type the number that you want in there, press Control and Enter, and voila, it will put all of those, it will populate all of those cells with that exact entry. Now it also works for things like formulas. So in Excel, there is a little formula called RAND, and what that does, it populates the cell with a random number. So let's just go and have a look how you might do that. If you just wanted a whole bunch of random numbers in these cells, I've highlighted the area first. I'll type equals R-A-N-D, open and close bracket, control and enter and that puts a whole bunch of random numbers in there now they're all a bit messy there so let's say we wanted to change that formula tad and what we wanted to do was make it so that it was more like whole numbers so if I just go back into the original cell and do multiplied by 100 now don't forget you've got to go hold down the control key and then press enter and that changes the whole lot. And then I could just, if I wanted to, change the decimal points, and I end up with a whole bunch of random numbers. The third thing is, you can move things really easily in an Excel sheet, a whole block of things. And with this block selected here, this, this range of cells, if I just hover over the border like that until the mouse pointer changes, click and drag, and I can make an exact copy. Uh, the next thing is really easy, just rolling the mouse wheel with the control key held down just zooms the sheet in and out, a very simple one. And then finally, and probably the simplest one, but in some ways the hardest one to get into the habit to, but believe me, it's going to save you digital bacon if you can get your head around this and, and, do, and, um, and get into this habit. You notice at the top here? It just says keyboard shortcuts in Excel. That's the name of the file. It's not saved at this stage. So if I just press Control and S, just watch what happens up here for a moment. It actually goes ahead and saves the file and then it puts the word saved up there. So that's my five top Excel keyboard shortcuts. And I can guarantee you that every time I open Excel, I will always use a combination of those keyboard shortcuts. And don't forget, if you do want the PDF download, just check in the description below. Hope you got something out of that. See you next time.